Show and I'm Steve and today we're going to do a how to session on how to load labels in the Godex G300 a label printer um, and as always we're going to have the bad photo ID of the day at the end of the show. Um, before we get started I want to talk a little bit about this printer. It's a Godex G300 thermal transfer printer meaning that it uses a ribbon and transfers that image onto the material you're using. Could be a label, could be um, um, tags or tickets, whatever you're using. This is an economical but very reliable printer and it can print up to a four and a quarter inch wide label at four inches per second, so it's a nice quick printer at 203 DPI. It uses standard low cost labels and ribbons. Comes standard with ethernet, um, also serial and USB ports, and has free labeling software, which will allow you to do 1, 1D and 2D barcodes and it's the only printer that, um, in its class of label printers that comes with a three-year warranty. So as promised, we're going to get into the how to load um, the label stock into this printer. And to help us with that is Douglas from our tech department. Thanks, Steve. Wait, Douglas. So what comes with the printer are these two tabs and then this core. And so what you want to do is pop open the cover. Um, you're actually going to want to make sh and with this green core, you're going to want to put it in, put the ribbon around it. I mean the, the label around it, but make sure that it goes over the top when you put it in, and not under the bottom. Go ahead and drop in the slots in the back. Well, first actually, is you want to put these two tabs on and slide it in. You want to make sure you can eye them. There's actually a measure on the top, kind of like a ruler to measure and see if they are even. And from there, you want to go ahead and drop it in there. Go ahead and pop open the bottom. Go ahead and run these through the guides. Once those guides are tightened, Go ahead and pull this through a little bit, push it down, tighten the ribbon, and you're good to go. All right, thanks Douglas. As you can see too, when he was doing that, there's green plastic uh, where you're supposed to touch it, so it's really easy to find out where you touch everything to make it open and, and slide everything in, so it's user friendly. As promised, here's the bad photo ID of the day, and while you're looking at that, if you have any questions, submit them to us on our Facebook portion of our website, idedge.com. Uh, you can call us also at 800-798-3343. We're here to help you and save you some money.